Hello, my name is Jung Seo-go from Gwangju Institute of Science and Technology, and I would like to present Lumi Mood, a creativity support tool for designing the mood of a 3D scene. In this work, we propose Lumi Mood, which generates template lighting and post-processing designs to support the mood designing of 3D scenes. When designers create a 3D scene, they consider the mood design, which would possess intended emotions for the game players. Designing an emotionally engaging environment is a core task in the development of digital games. The emotional tone impacts the user experience of game players, influencing their motivation and engagement. Studies have focused on automating the design process of a 3D scene, but less attention has been given to the generation of the mood of the 3D scene. With the advent of generative technologies, studies have shown successful creativity support tools or CESDs that benefit the designers. These studies have presented effective technologies that streamline the workflow of designing a 3D scene by generating meshes, textures, and object arrangement. Utilizing these techniques allows users to create high-quality scenes in a shorter amount of time. However, since these studies do not focus on crafting the overall emotional atmosphere of the scenes, they do not consider how designers actually design the mood of the scene. From interviews with 10 game designers in our formative study, we found that most designers utilize lighting and post-processing effects to create the mood of the scene. Therefore, in this study, we focus on the effect of lighting and post-processing on mood designing. From the formative study, we found that the designers undergo four stages to translate the abstract mood concept into concrete actual designs. Challenges of mood designing arise between each step. The first challenge is where designers struggle with the abstractness of mood concept. The designers noted that mood designing is creatively demanding. Because mood concepts do not have specific shapes, Envisioning the actual visual representation of a mood requires translating the abstract concepts into actual visual representations. The second challenge involves the labor-intensive baseline workflow required to connect visual representations to actual property values. Designers follow a trial and error process to create the visual representation of a scene. The iterative design process is considered as labor-intensive and difficult to adopt. The last challenge arises owing to properties that are difficult to understand. To achieve successful design, designers need a comprehensive understanding of how each property affects different parts of the scene. Designers find it difficult to select the appropriate properties to adjust to achieve their designed outcome during the design process. To overcome these challenges, we propose LumiMood, an AI-driven CESD that supports the designing process of lighting and post-processing effects. Next, we will present how LumiMood is designed. First, for usability, we implemented a user interface as an add-on to the Unity engine. Through the UI of LumiMood, users can interact with our system without having to know about how the backend actually works. As mentioned before, LumiMood is designed to handle three challenges that we found in our formative study. LumiMood is composed of three components, generator, creator, and recaller. Each component aims to solve each challenge. The first component of LumiMood is the generator. The generator synthesizes images that designers can refer to in the ideation stage. With text prompts, the generator allows designers to generate images that possess the mood they intend. We train the diffusion model on an effective image dataset with machine-generated captions. The generator takes the current scene image and the text prompt explaining the desired mood as input and outputs a synthesized image. The second component of LumiMood is the creator. The creator is a component that adjusts appropriate values for lighting and post-processing properties to make the scene resemble the image that the generator synthesized. Specifically, the creator is a grid search algorithm that finds optimal values for lighting and post-processing components. The creator takes the current scene and the reference image as inputs and outputs a template scene that resembles the reference image. 
The last component of LumiMood is the recaller, which displays the intermediate design steps between the initial scene and the designed template scene suggested by the creator. While displaying how the scene has changed, the recaller also allows designers to create their designs from the intermediate scene, which ensures controllability of the design workflow. When the creator designs the template scene, the recaller stores the changes in lighting and post-processing properties, then restores intermediate designs. To verify the effectiveness of LumiMood, we designed a user study that involves two subtasks. The user study involves scene replication task and a mood designing task. The first task is a scene replication task, which requires the designers to adjust the lighting and post-processing design to resemble with the target scene. The designers were instructed to design an initial scene on the left that closely resembled the target scene on the right. The designers created the scenes using both the baseline and LumiMood workflows. The next task is a mood designing task, which requires the designers to design the mood of a given scene to evoke a target emotion. In this task, the designers were instructed to freely design the mood of an initial scene to evoke the target emotion in the game players. Six emotion keywords were given based on Paris model. We conducted a user study with 40 game designers, including 20 professionals and 20 novices. The professional game designers had at least five years of experience in the game development industry, whereas novice game designers had less experience. Through the user study, we observed how LumiMood benefits the efficiency and satisfaction of the mood designing process. First, we observed the overall designing time and mouse and keyboard interaction counts during the scene replication task. The results indicate that using LumiMood significantly decreases designing time and interaction counts. Therefore, we concluded that both professional and novice designers have experienced increased efficiency in their designing process. Next, we observed how the designers were satisfied with their workflow and the design outcome in the mood designing task. The results indicate that there is a significant increase in the satisfaction of workflow and design outcome when using LumiMood. Specifically, novices showed a more drastic increase in satisfaction compared to the professionals. In the mood designing task, we also observed how many times the designers used recaller to interpret the template scene or control the scene from the intermediate design steps. The result shows that professionals showed higher usage of the recaller, meaning that the professionals were more active in controlling the template scene than the novices. Following the result of the recaller usage count, we found that the difference between the template scene that LumiMood generated and the final design outcome is significantly larger on the professionals than the novices. This means that while the novices tend to follow the template scene, professionals tend to modify to create their own designs. From the result, we have derived some implications for better AI-driven CSTs. Previous studies have shown that guaranteeing user control over the tasks increases their preference for CESTs. We found that novice relied more on automation, whereas professionals followed a more involved process of designing rather than relying solely on the automation. Thus, we suggest that the preference for the balance between automation and control may differ among designers, especially depending on their experience levels. Furthermore, although providing reference images can improve both design satisfaction and performance, designers have pointed out that design fixation may happen when they use AI. Therefore, we suggest that the generalizability of an AI for synthesizing desired images is a key factor in building CGSTs for inspiring the designer's creativity. Thank you so much, and I hope you to check out our paper, LumiMood, a creativity support tool for designing the mood of a 3D scene.